Hi students, so today we're going to be looking at using Pixlr X. So let's go ahead and go there. So we'll go and use the link here on your lesson plan and you're going to upload the work that you do in your digital portfolio PowerPoint. So go ahead and rewatch the video on vector versus raster graphics. And then this is the intro to Pixlr X video. So go to Pixlr X. Okay, and this is the introduction to the video. So go ahead and when you see the, um, the interface here, um, there are different ones here. We're not going to be paying for anything, um, but you can log in and you can go ahead and create an account. Um, as you can see here, this is the history of the images that I've opened so far. And we're going to be creating something a bit like this. So we'll go ahead and let's go ahead and create a new image. We're going to be using full HD. So that's 1920 by 1080 pixels. And we're going to rename it our last name underscore our first name underscore raster graphic. Okay, go and uh, click create and let's take a tour of the interface. So on the interface, we've got the home button. Then we've got the uh, properties so we can change how big the image is. So if we don't want it to be full HD, we want it to be Instagram size then we can change it there. Um, this is the arrange button so we can go ahead and move, transform and change layer settings or click on the shortcut V for so short. We've got crop so you can crop, rotate, straighten the canvas. Uh, this is the cutout button. So this is how we can remove backgrounds. So there's images that have a background or a white background. We can go ahead and cut those out. We can go ahead and adjust things like colors, lightness, darkness in different layers, put on filters, uh, create effects, uh, use a liquify tool to push some pixels around, use the retouch button to get rid of any, any pimples or anything like that. Um, then there's a drawing or doodling tool, there's a text button, then there's the add element and then add image button from a library or you can upload an image from your computer. Over here on the right hand side we've got the navigate button so you can zoom in and zoom out over here and this is how we can add layers. Okay, all right, so that's a, the tour and the next tutorial we'll go ahead and start the, uh, the tutorial, okay.